Hey, what's up, YouTube viewers? How's it hanging? Here I am on my way to Roseville, California. I'm going to uh, Sunsplash slash golf course, um, water park, and so forth. Uh, I came across uh, this individual on Facebook Market. He has a lot. Yeah. Um, and I mean by a lot, I mean by three boxes. So it's it's a bulk lot um, of baseball cards and uh, basketball cards. I think he has some football cards also. He listed it for 150. Uh, I don't mind paying 150. He does have the King Griffey Jr. Upper Deck set, so uh, that car is supposedly be being included as well. Um, so I thought maybe it would be cool to see uh, how the process goes as far as making deals and uh, picking up lots and so forth on any other uh, networking or social media market uh, place out there. So I'll uh, get back to you guys later and we'll go from there. whole book is Griffey's. Justin Griffey Senior, War Griffey Autograph Series. There's even one of him. It's a, it was his high school card, right? College card somewhere. Let's see here. Oh, right here. High school all American Oh, yeah, card. that's the, uh, yeah. I don't know if that's worth anything. I mean, there's some old ones. Tops, all-star rookie. That whole binder's full of Griffey's in, huh? Yeah! Well, this is all Griffey. It's all Griffey. Griffey. And then we get, so here's more Griffey. And then Dave Parker, Ricky Peterson. <laughs> Oh, some clippings. A clipping with all the cards of the rookies of that year or something. Yeah. Green team. And then you get into uh, some Barry Sanders. Tim Griffey. Yeah, that's a nice one right there. Henderson. That's a good one. I don't know what this is. The Giants. The Bonds. Anyways. For I never really did that. Well, that's nice. All the binders are with it. Yeah, and these binders are expensive too. Oh, see. They're like twenty bucks, brand new. There you go. Yeah. So these are score. Nineteen ninety. Don Russ. Nineteen ninety. Yeah, that's a favored year too. It is. Yeah, I like that year. Okay, so yeah. Here's that. And this is all miscellaneous stuff, so let's see what this is. Oh, that's the Don Ross Blue Series, too. Is that the King Griffey? Yeah. So, I don't know if those are... So, see, they came out with mini sets, like yeah, the see, blue... Yeah, here's the checklist. Yeah, the checklist. And this one was the same year, right? but just a different background picture. Yeah, see, so here's the checklist for 1 to 34. Yeah. And then the rest is 73, whatever. Cool. No clue. Okay, next... Some tops. These are all major league de debut, so there's when they. Yeah, so they're special, special edition cards. Yeah, when when. For that set. Yeah, for when people started, I guess their first day of playing, right? Debut major league debut. Yeah, pretty much. Hey, what's up, everyone? So I went ahead and made that purchase. I got the uh, the King Griffey, right there. It looks pretty prestige nice and square um, I'm gonna go ahead and head back to the house and I'll go ahead and uh, pull some cards out to let you guys see what I paid for $150 uh, not too bad up here at uh, Splash uh, Splash City I think in Roseville 
And uh, when hey, what's up, everybody? I am here back from picking up that lot. It was uh, 150. Uh, so this is what it all came down to right here. I have the 86 through 91 tops. I have the um, upper deck, the 91, 90, and 89 set. And I had a couple of, uh, I had a 90 score. And I have some basketball hoops. Plus I got this ball, which was kind of cool. Um, these little ones, they were just basic um, binders with cards. I went ahead and uh, cherry picked all of them already so that way we could save time. And um, I'm going to show you what cards that I pulled out uh, from this whole set that are actually worth money and hold value. Um, that have air cards as far as the, uh, the older sets. I'm going to leave these in here for sale. Um, you know, someone might pick them up. For a couple of dollars like for one of these maybe like three four bucks and uh, maybe sell these for you know a couple bucks also i let these go for uh five dollars once i've cherry picked through them and see there's a card missing there once i went through them already and um took what i want what i do is i go through each uh set with the beckett and find air cards um known rookie cards that came up and so I, I left a, uh, sometimes I'll leave once in, once in a while, while I'll leave some uh, key players, like I, uh, there's an Owen Ryan, and uh, once in a while I'll leave those in there, so that way it gives the buyer a little bit more for his money. But I only let these go for five bucks or so. Um, so I'm gonna go ahead and, and uh, show you what I got. All right guys, I'm back from that big break from um, that purchase that I got up in Rails, Roseville. Uh, one of the things that I wanted to mention when uh, it came, as you've seen, the, the sets 86 through, um, I think it was 91, they came with all the traded as well. So I got all the um, all the traded cards as far as the set in each set. And I thought that was kind of neat because uh, it's very rare when you find um, lots for sale on whether it's... Um, Facebook or Craigslist or offer up they don't come with the uh, traded sets so I got all the sets plus um, the traded and that was from 86 to 91 so that was really neat on that aspect um, other than that these are some of the key uh, cards that I uh, pulled out there's another traded that's a Bo Jackson um, the PHT. another traded for Randy Johnson uh, so forth Nolan Ryan so I got all the key players. I didn't get that one, that John. Uh, he's not um, on a tease. But anyways, I got, see there's Bo Jackson. He came in traded too. So I got a lot of key players um, with the, uh, the traded cards. There's my 86. Just gonna go through them. So that way you get an idea what I pulled out of those. Uh, and I didn't get the air card on the uh, Nolan Ryan um, but I got a lot of good decent cards at really good um, in shape as far as being in quality um, so all these cards that I pulled I'll be sending off to um, to uh, get graded I did pull an air there's the air uh, 87 record breakers with uh, Eddie Murray uh, that's another T uh, there's not that one's not T. Um, so uh, there it is, like Henderson. So I got a lot of good cards. I ran out of um, uh, some. They had a binder just full of Bo Jacksons, and uh, that was kind of cool. This was a cool card I've never had. Never had this card, and so forth. Toys R Us. But I ran out of these top loaders, so I had to just put them inside of my pink sleeves, which was not a bad deal as well uh, you know and I got the hoops so like I pulled out all the key rookie players all-stars uh, cards that are worth money as far as grading them this is a uh, an air card the clean shaven uh, so this is the air card right here it's only worth a couple dollars but you know so if you're out there and you see the uh, see um, 
a set on offer up or uh, any other uh, these were kind of cool too uh, these chicks I never seen them uh, so I got cards that I've never seen before um, I got another had it had another binder of uh, of um, Consecos so there was a binder of Consecos and this was in there Montana so I went ahead and pulled all of the key players as you see I have for $150 plus I got that uh, King Griffey Jr. upper deck uh, also um, I mean that was a good deal uh, as far as 150 bucks uh, there's a nice uh, card Nolan Ryan with the football it's a unique unique card um, so I think it's kind of worth it to me because uh, as 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 we move into the the hundred benchmark of trading cards, uh, some of these cards are going to become more valuable. Uh, if you look into the Beckett, that's why I'd like to go by the Beckett. Sometimes this is another air card. See his name is different on the other card. That's why I have two of them. I wanted to show you, Jamie Winston and Mickey Winston. So this is the air card. That's not his name. It's only worth a couple bucks, but. Um, you know, if they're listed in the Beckett, there's another air card because it doesn't have the strike. So I think that one's worth like five bucks. See how it has the 300 to win? It doesn't have it right there. Chipper Jones, um, all the key guys. Let me show you my uh, King Griffey Jr. And then I'm going to go ahead and um, upload this so you guys can check it out. So here's the uh, King Griffey Jr. upper deck rookie card. It's actually not too bad. The corners are pretty good. It uh, looks a little scuffed up like right here, but I don't know if it's because of, you see it right there, right there, right here. So it's right, right there. Um, other than that, it looks pretty good and squared. So I paid $150 for the lot. I pulled my King Griffey Jr. Rookie and um, I came up with a bunch of other all-stars and, uh, and so forth as far as um, people that are becoming more knowledgeable in um, collecting cards as well you're going to notice that these cards will hold value and now's the time to start grabbing them up and and um, holding on to them I'll send these off into uh, get graded because they're not too bad they're actually really good cards um, it's a nice Bo Jackson so I'm going to upload this video. Let me know, comment, view on what you think on the purchase. If it was worth uh, $150 for King Griffey Jr. 1989 Upper Deck.